I right, invite y'all, let's get right to it. Waiting up time already, let's hop right to it. Happy Monday, all right, welcome to Corn Boar. My name is Eric, thanks for joining me this Monday, all right? So we'll start with the warm up. Come up to a standing position here. We will start with knees to chest, nice and slow. You can hold it as long as you need to each side. Pull it up, hold it, and switch. We're just gonna beat those hips here, all right? Couple more in here, couple more. Three, two, one. All right, reverse it now. Heel to glute. Little quad stretch here. Hold it for a couple seconds as well. Drop it back down. Just not these quads here. Yo, there, there we go. A couple more, a couple more. Three. Two, one, all right, all right. From here, we go ride to some inchworm mountain climbers, all right? So we're gonna walk it out to that inchworm. Four mountain climbers, walk it back up and go. I'm gonna keep that core engaged. Drive those knees toward that chest. Nice control. And back on the, in that inchworm, gonna let those hips drop, nice. Strong plank there, strong core. Right, got about 10 seconds. All right, on your next inch run, we'll go right to some Superman. All right, your next inch run, right to the Superman. And go. And we drop it to the belly. All right, lifting up, squeezing those glutes, drop it back down. You can hold each move for a couple seconds. And back down there, all right. So we squeeze that core, engage that back. Good work, good work. There we go, there we go. Really squeeze those uh, boots at the top. Get some of that pressure up that lower back. We got 10 seconds. Last couple of reps in. Five, four, three, two, one. And relax, 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 all right? Let's get right to it, y'all. So for today, we're gonna start with some three minute rounds, all right? In those three minute rounds, there are three exercises. Each one will be 30 seconds. So we'll do each exercise twice, all right? So let me get my time and set it up. First three exercises, all right? The first one is two parts, so we will start on one side for 30 seconds and switch it to the opposite side for the next 30 seconds, all right? It's gonna be a half get up, all right? So, I'm real quick. So grab that dumbbell if you have one. If you don't, that's fine. Still get the work done here without it, all right? So we're gonna start here on the right side or the left side, either or works, all right? It's on the right side, that right knee up, and that left leg is straight, all right? All you're doing, Pressing that dumbbell up towards the sky, core tight, using that core to come up, coming up to that left elbow and down, all right? So using that core, pressing that dumbbell towards the sky, bringing it back down. Just make sure you keep that wrist stacked over that shoulder and the entire exercise, all right? So remember, you start with the right side, right side, then we go do the left side, all right? Right after that, we got some Superman flutters, all right? So we go pick it up from the warm up, add a little swimming, Motion to it, all right, leg and arm motion, all right, so we're here. Up, squeeze those glutes, just like we're swimming here, all right, so nice and easy. Same motion, just move those arms, try to stay in that fixed position, squeeze those that core, and we're gonna work, all right, so remember, we're doing this twice, got three exercises, three minutes, start with that half get up, grab that dumbbell or you can do it with that weight as it works as well, right? Everyone ready? And three, two, one. Let's work. And a half. Get a press towards the sky. Coming up to that elbow. Drop it down. All right. Coming to the opposite elbow there. And use the core to control the movement here. Coming up and down. Right. Keeping that wrist stacked over that shoulder. Nice, strong core. Keep it up, y'all. We're going to switch sides in five, four, three, 
four, three, two, one. Switch sides. Same thing. Let's get it. Pressing up. Back down. Right. Get that core. Good job, good. 10 seconds. We're going to flip it over. We got some Superman flutters. And off the first round here in three, two, one. All right, flip it over. Prone position. Superman flutters. Let's get it. Other options. If you would like to just try Superman, that works as well. All right. Superman flutters just a little more challenging there. And we keep those loops squeezed together, core tight. There we go, I see our feet moving, there we go. Keep it up, keep it up. Remember, we got one more round. So these three exercises, get ready in three, two, one. Back on our back, back to that half, get up. Last round here, and go. We're gonna do both sides again. And off with those Superman flexes. And we get a break. Let's knock it out here. Work that core good, good. Number control. Keep that dumbbell or that uh, wrist stacked over that shoulder. The entire time you feel like it's slacking down a little bit, just drop that weight. Use your arm, all right? Use that body weight. Get the form right, keep going, y'all. Last couple seconds, three. Two, one, switch it up, and go. And we try to keep that elbow straight as well. Keep it up, keep it up. Touch that dumbbell towards the ceiling, good, good. We got about 10 seconds. And it's strong here. Superman flutters in three. Two, one, let's end it off. End it off right. Superman flutters gets to get it. Finally swim to that shore. All right, squeeze those blues. Let's go, let's go. That's easy work. Right, good job, y'all. Good job. You got about 10 seconds. Last couple of seconds, finish strong. Three, two, one, and relax, relax, relax. All right, real quick, real quick, flip it over. 30 second plank. Let's do a 30 second plank and go. I throw a little curve bar chart at the end. 30 seconds here, we holding that plank, knees, forearms, or even full plank here on your hands. All right, we got about 10 seconds. We got a break. Finish strong, finish strong. Five, four, three, two, one. And relax, relax. Take it all out. Good round, y'all. Be done with that. Thumbs up. Get some water. All right. Moving on. All right. New set of exercises here. Got more core to go. All right. Keep those dumbbells close. All right, next three we got. We're gonna start off on our back, right? So we're here in a fix, almost a V-sit position, all right? We're gonna try some rope climbing, all right? So you can bring your feet up in the air or drop it to the ground, all right? So you can be ten, climbing up a rope, keep, keep that core tight, all right? You can try that for about 15 seconds. I'm going to say switch. Go right into some Russian twist. All right. So start the rope climbing. Core tight. Walk it up. All right. And back into those Russian twists. All right. So that's the first move. All right. After that, we're going to drop it to our belts. All right. We got some windshield wipers. All right. So remember options here. Legs can be bent or legs can be straight. All right. Make sure you keep that lower back in contact with the floor. Your knees or legs don't have to touch the ground here. Go as far as you can go using those core muscles to move your legs side to side here, all right? Make sure you keep those shoulders 
square with the uh, ceiling or sky, core tight and keep working there, all right? And then we'll end off with some hamstring walkout, all right? So in the bridge position here, we we'll just add some movement, lifting up, walking out on our heels. It doesn't matter how many steps, you can do one step each side or two or three, all right? Just make sure, group squeeze together, core tight, and keep that great form, all right? So rock climbing, Russian twist, that's how we gonna start it off. Same thing here, we got three minutes. Set my timer. Everyone ready? In three, two, one, let's work. 15 seconds, rock climbing, or rope climbing here, all right? Let me switch to the Russian twist. You can use that dumbbell as well. Get ready, three, two, one, let's go, twist it up here. Good, good. Twisting towards that hip. Core tight. Good work, y'all. Good work. Then we got some windshield wipers next. Three, two, one. Lay it back. Got some more rotational movements here. Legs straight or knees bent. Just make sure core tight. Keep that chest and shoulders square towards that ceiling. All right, you don't want your back coming off the ground. Just moving at the hips here. All right, keep working now. Use those core muscles to perform the movement. We got bridges, walk out in three, two, one. Let's lift it up, let's walk it out. Walk it out on those heels, walk it back. All right, you do need to tone it down a little bit. All right, just lift them into that bridge, hold it, and drop it back down, all right? So the option there, add that movement with that bridge or just lift up those hips, squeeze that core, squeeze the boost at the top and drop it back down. Keep it up, y'all. Last couple of seconds, we'll go back to the beginning. For the last round, three, two, one, back to the climbing and go. Rope climbing, let's go, y'all. Last round. Act like you're reaching each time, bringing that tension in that core. It's more challenging, lift those feet off the ground. All right, more of a challenge there with that balance. I think this is on that core there. Keep it up, keep it up. You're ready for Russian twist in three, two, one. Let's twist it up. Russian twist here. All right, all right. We got some more windshield wipers. Get ready in three, two, one. Lay it back, windshield wipers. Knock them out, knock them out. Here we go, last round here. We got another break coming up soon. We working hard. About 10 seconds. Then we got some more walkouts. Get ready. And three, two, one. Walk out, Bridget. Let's get it. Walk it out, walk it back in. Definitely feel down the hamstrings as well as the glutes. Getting those strong legs with that core. Keep it up, keep it up. Last couple of seconds. Finish strong here. We go end off with a hollow hold. In three, two, one. Let's go. Hollow hold to end it off. But if you do need to, you can start your break. Just for extra challenge here. All right. Arms overhead, knees bent, or legs straight, arms overhead. Keep that lower back in contact with the floor. We got 15 seconds. Hold it here, hold it, hold it, hold it. Good, good. Finish strong here, last couple seconds. Three, two, one. And relax, relax. Good work, good work. High five. Great round, y'all. Check it out. Give a quick little stretch in. We got one more of these before we move on, all right? One more of these before we move on here. Get some water. Y'all come back to regroup. And I'll go through the last three with this format here, all right? All right, all right. Everybody's about ready. Let's get right to it. So first one. 
You grab those dumbbells or use body weight. We got some snow angels. I know it's almost summer, but we can still do snow angels here, all right? So squeeze that core, keep that lower back in contact with the floor, all right? Remember, legs straight, coming overhead, just like a snow angel, open those legs and back, all right? So maybe you can use weight, all right? Or just body weight here works as well. Make sure you keep that nice, strong core. First move, right after that, we're gonna stay on our backs. Go right to some dead bugs, the right some stability. So you keep those dumbbells in hand, extend opposite arm and legs, and keep it moving here. Keep that lower back in contact with the floor. We got some dead bugs. And then we'll end off with some up down planks. All right, flip it over. Plank position, drop it down to those elbows, walk it back up. You can switch which side goes down first each time. Give both sides equal work there. All right. And then do it again. And we'll be about done with this here, all right? So start with those snow angels. Same thing, 30 seconds. Ready, three, two, one, let's get it. Work hard here, y'all. That great form. If you feel like you're losing form, you're using weights, drop those weights. Use body weight, you'll still get the job done there. And also protect yourself from that injury. All right, keep it up, keep it up. Last couple of seconds, we got those dead bugs. Three, two, one, let's go. Right to those dead bugs. The opposite arm and leg here. There we go, there we go. 10 seconds. Then we got those up, down planks next. Get ready, five, four, three, two, one. Flip it over, up, down planks, let's get it. Step it down, walk it back up. Good, good, good. Now keep that core tight with those planks, don't let those hips drop. Nice straight line, line with that body there. Yeah, good. Last couple of seconds here, we're going back to the start. All right, Snow Angels, three, two, one. Just ended off right on our back, Snow Angels. Let's knock it out here. Remember, no arch in that lower back. Keep that lower back in contact with the floor. And sure as you're engaging that core there. Really working it. Good, good, good. Yep, there we go. Looking good, y'all. Finish strong here. Got some dead bugs in three, two, one. Let's get it. Knock it out here. We're almost done. Got the up down planks and we got another break. Keep it up, keep it up. Last couple seconds, three, two, one. Flip it over, up down planks. Another break incoming, about 25 seconds. Keep working hard. Get that strong core, good, good. Everybody's moving. Way to push y'all, way to push. Got about 10 seconds. Been a strong here. Last couple seconds. Three, two, one. And relax, relax. Thumbs up, thumbs up. Take it all out. Good work. We are done with that format, but we are not done with class, all right? So just take your break. I'll let you know what we got next, all right? Almost done here, though, I promise. Got about four to five more minutes. Did we stretch it out? And we're done for the day, all right? So here we go try next. I'll say between two movements here, all right? We're going to throw in some burpees, all right? We're going to alternate it with a hollow hold, all right? So working on some movement, dynamic movement, and also 
some stabilization. All right, each one be 30 seconds. We go try them twice, so two minutes, and then we get a break and we switch up the exercises. All right, so remember burpees up here, jump it up, jump it out. All right, maybe we can also come to those toes, step it back, or even walk it down to that ground if you need to. All right, so burpees, then go right to a hollow hold. Two rounds, y'all ready? In three, two, one, let's work. Tommy I mean, Burpees, you can get in this round. Next round, try to beat it. Try to keep that count. All right, for extra challenge here. Good, good, 15 seconds. Number hollow hole next. Get ready. And three, two, one, on our back, hollow hole, let's get it. Stabilization work here. Good work, good work, good work. Got 15 seconds. Let's hold it, y'all, we got it, we got it. Last couple seconds, we got some more burpees. Last round, three, two, one, bring it up. More burpees, let's go. Remember, try to beat your rep count for last round, All right? Or even tie. Even if it's by one rep, that's fine. Still beat it. Good, good. Everybody's moving pretty quickly here. Good work, y'all. Good work. Ready to push. Got about 10 seconds. Or actually, less than that. Three, two, one. Drop it to the ground. Hello, hold. Let's get it. Hold it out. Hold it out. Get another quick break after this. Hold, hold, hold. Here we go, y'all. Way to push. Way to push. 10 seconds. Last couple of seconds, three, two, one, and relax, relax, relax. Good work, good work. Check it out, check it out. I'll let you know what's coming up next here. All right, so now two minute round here. We're gonna pair with the plank, all right? So we on our backs. First move. We're gonna try some flutter kicks here, all right? So just easy flutter kicks, all right? And we can bend the knees a little bit if we need to. Just try to keep that core tight. Back engage with that floor, all right? Back to that, flip it over. And we go hold a plank, all right? So we got two minutes. After this, we're gonna end off with a 30 second push up after the last plank, a 30 second push up. So what that is, 15 seconds down, 15 seconds up, all right? So I'll do the counting there. Once we're done with that, it's all over. All right. So we got flutter kicks to start it off. Ready. Three, two, one. Let's work. I'm going to try to keep the legs straight, but if you need to, you can bend those knees. Try to keep those legs moving. And keep working here. All right. We got the first plank coming up in five, four, three, two, one. Let's hold. Flip it over. Come on, y'all. We got this. It's almost over. Promise. Let's keep working for these last one and a half, two minutes, and we're about done here. Good, good, great form, y'all. Keep it up, keep it up. Got some more flutter kicks coming up. Get ready. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, flutter kicks. Let's get it. Last round of these. Good, good. 15 seconds. We got another plank. Keep it up, y'all. Keep it up. 
Work that core. We got this. We got this. Got plank code in three, two, one. Slip it over. Plank code. All right. Then we go end off with that 30 second push up. All right. Remember that push up you can do from your knees or full push up position. All right. And I'll do the counting for y'all. All right, all right, 10 seconds. Get ready for that. We're gonna be going down. Get ready. And five, four, three, two, one. 30 seconds, push it, let's go. We're going down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, coming up, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. Good work, good work, good work. Check it out. High five, thumbs up. See another workout. Good job, y'all. We're going to stretch it out now, right? So. If you're in that position, go right into your child's pose. If you're on your knees, go right to that child's pose. Push those heads back, drop that forehead to the ground. And we're going to stretch it out here. All right. Nice to hold. Take a couple deep breaths. Bring that heart rate back down. And when you're ready, walk those hands over to the right, sorry, the left side of your body. And walk those hands over to the right side. And walking back to the middle, we'll come up to a cobra, upper dog, drop those hips, open up that heart here. You kind of rock your hips side to side, loosen up that back as well. And rocking back from here, we go back to all sports position. All right. We're going to start off with a, um, Thread the needle, all right? So use that right hand, open up towards the sky as far as you can, and go right underneath our left arm. We're gonna hold it here. You rest your head on the ground. Just go take back just a little bit here. Your shoulder stretch. And slowly release, bring it up, and switch hands. Left hand comes up, reach towards the sky, and thread that needle underneath the right. Arm. And continue to, to breathe. Bring that heart rate back down. And slowly release there. Go right back to all fours here. Try some cat and cow. All right, so we we'll start by dropping our belly, arching our back. Just gotta open the heart, inhale, exhale, round it out. Inhale. All right, you're in. Exhale, round it out. And one more time. Inhale, round it in. And exhale, round it out. And slowly release that. Shake it out, shake it out. Come to a kneeling position here. Grab our left heel with our left hand. Right hand comes up. Nice good back bend. Hold it for a couple seconds and switch. You can go at your own pace here. And inhale, exhale as you bend back. A couple more here. And try one more on each side. And slowly release there. Come to the standing position. We're almost done. Start with a little side bend. So right leg in the front, back, uh, left leg back, right, 
left arm comes up and over. And we go hold it here for a couple of seconds. And slowly release, switch sides. Same thing, up and over, right hand. And slowly release, release. We'll cross over our right foot over our left leg here. So if you need a wall to hold on to, you can or lean on. If not, push those hips back. Go stretch out the glutes here. Hold it, hold it, hold it. And slowly release, switch sides. Same thing. And slowly release, and we end off here, reaching for our toes. Hold it here for a couple of seconds. And when you're ready, slowly roll up one vertebrae at a time, nice and gentle. So you get to the top, reach the sky. Add some shoulder rolls at the top. A couple of neck rolls as well, loosen up. Take it all out. And we are done, y'all. The work. How are we feeling? Hope you got enough sweat. Good. Cool and tight. There we go. There we go. Yeah, Monday. Uh, thank you. All right. No problem. No problem. We got a good work out here. Thanks, Sarah. Right. That was great. Thank no you. No problem. Thank you. Have a good one, y'all. Bye. Have a good night. Uh, you too, man. Bye, everyone. Hey, Eric, you want to stay on this line or should we do the uh, other one? Um, this one's fine.